Again, no sponsor. But this shit is bussin'. All right, so we took the city. I don't think we lost any... I don't think we lost any battalions. Probably not. At least I hope not. But uh, regardless, we'll just be able to get them right back. Has no um, let's go ahead and grab that. You're drinking that too? Good shit. A toast to our well-earned victory. Our Wait, does that mean the wall failed, or are they going to be coming for me now? Kara Kern is gone. I'm pretty sure the wall is still going on. Yeah. Uh-oh. Well, um, you know what, man? Let, let, the, let the orcs come. Let them come. I'll kill them with a stun. Yep. Bone breaker. Bone breaker time. Bone breaker time. Now he's on a big ol' ogre. A specially engineered braid of rat ogre. The bone breaker has a braced platform strapped in or bolted to its back for carrying a skaven warlord into battle oh yeah oh yeah it's all coming together now excellent excellent all right cool can we buy that from you can we buy this land from you do you think man would you, would you be down for that come on man um can we trade are you still friends with the... Ugh, still friends with the green skins. That's a shame. Alright, well... We're doing a lot better now, actually. Science. Let's go ahead Sorcery. and upgrade. Death. Warp Smart is good, but I think what I wanted to start doing is... Yeah, let's start working into more of his personal skills, actually. Make him a... Make him a real force to be reckoned with. Can I do anything with you? No, no movement from him. I was going to put him into an offensive uh, camp encampment, but... Does not look like we're rocking with that. At least not this turn. Not yet, minion. Not yet. Warlock Engineer. What do we want to do with you? Hmm. Block Army? Sure. Why not? Let's actually go ahead and just explore all of these settlements over here. Ooh, another one of these puzzles. Okay, not that. Not that. Not that. Not that. So it's a downward triangle again. Ooh. A corrosive blade. Very nice. What do we want to... We should actually... I think now that we're here, we should probably... No, we definitely need to do Ikit's quest now to get Storm Demon. Since we've actually had such a big old influx of food, with more on the way after this, I think our next priority should be upgrading our Doom Rockets. Uh, warp power plant. I think, which one is it? The dirty... The dirty bomb, yeah. Yeah, there we go. The chemical warp heads. Let's go and grab those. And then... Weapon teams. Broom, broom. Zap, zap. I really love the poison wound mortars, too. We gotta get them as well. Um... Hmm. Warp fire throwers, I like. However, are there any upgrades that could... What's the best mount for Ikit? So, it really is up to personal preference. Me, personally, I always keep him on a Doom Flayer. I like that because he's a lot quicker than he would be on a Doom Wheel. And plus, I'm pretty sure he has armor-piercing damage. And yeah, look at all the downsides to being on a Doom Wheel. Less armor, less leadership, less speed, less melee attack. It's, it's kind of gnarly. He does get ammunition, though, because the Doom Wheel can fire off a little mini lightning cannon, I believe. But I don't know. I don't think the trade-off is worth it. And plus, the Doom Flayer, I don't know if I mentioned this. I might have. But it has armor piercing. And that's really, really good. Almost invaluable, I'd say, against dwarves. So that's the thing. Dwarves. Dwarf things have their scaly armor hides. Yes, yes. Let's go ahead and actually... Let's... No, let's continue upgrading the infrastructure. We can get the cool cannons later. Right now... Right now, I think we're better off, uh, you know, investing in ourselves, making sure we're making more money in the future. I 
I'm gonna be honest, bro. Sylvania. Like, I know we're on good terms with vampires right now. That's why I had to sow those seeds at the beginning of the campaign. Otherwise, we'd be shitting our pants because we'd be sandwiched between the greenskins and the vampires. We can probably get the vampires to help us out with the green screen the greenskins when it comes to it, but uh uh oh. Oh, Undercity established, not Undercity discovered. Very nice. Uh, how much money are we making here, by the way? Not, not a lot, actually. Hmm. Could upgrade this, actually. We could. Hmm. We'll, we'll save that for later. We'll save that for later. How are we doing down here? How's our Undercity over here? Anything? Yes, let's upgrade this right away. Ratkin Mafia. Okay. Unfortunately, though, yeah, I think that's going to put us over the edge. Let's wait until this is done, and then we'll upgrade. How'd you get the Rat Ogre mount, or is that another one of your heroes? So, okay, so for Ikit, he actually can't get a Rat Ogre mount. Uh, that's a different hero. This is a Warlord. This is a Warlord, yeah. Ikit is unfortunately only, uh... No, no! He can only do, like, uh, machines and stuff. Do you want to join our salty I crew? Bring the nice. I'm going to pay you for a non-aggression pack, so that way, eventually, we can become friends. Thousand gold. Bro, this dude's about to get shit on. He's going to come to me in five turns and be like, help, help. I'm being repressed. Bloody peasant. Go and search the brimstone mine. What do we got here? Oh, I hate this one. To access the treasure, the old ones believes alignment is all. Ugh, what a drag. Hmm. All right, so there's a 25% chance we get this right, chat. Oh. Warp lightning conductor charged. I am. I am. I am that dude. I am that dude. Let's go ahead and actually start to change out the weapon. Actually, I'm pretty sure if we change out weapons, that makes him a little more... That makes him more upset, doesn't it? Yeah. How are, ooh. Oh, we should... Ah, oh, completely forgot. My bad, bro. Completely forgot to give dude right here his props. By props, I do mean really cool weapons. Uh, melee defense, melee attack. Really nice. Ward save plus six. Potion of Foolhardiness is nice. Beard thinks Sacrifice, also very nice. Man thinks Slave. Scavenger. Clan Scryer Saboteur. Vermis, Ikit Claw. How are you doing, Ikit? How are we, how are we doing? Should probably be doing a lot better. Let's go ahead and combine these two armies, or at least some of them. Some of the troops, you know. So, you, you, and you. Now with Ikit's got something of a better front line. Let's go ahead and do this too. There we go. Because Ikit's about to go into battle and get his um, what do you call? It? He's about to get his weapon. So I want to make sure he has the best uh, the best troops possible because I don't want to fumble this ball. What are we fighting? Lizard men, right? Yeah, lizard men. Okay. Is that a uh, technical Ticlon? No, that's a uh, Tlaxbok. Yeah, because this is part of the Prophet and the Warlock DLC, if I remember correctly. So when you bought Ikit Claw, you bought um, Technic Ticlon as well. No threat of a challenge. Ooh, yeah, go ahead and become immortal. That's pretty cool. Now our Warlock engineer can never die. You love to see it. Stop hissing, bro. Your breath is stank. talking about has not been in the vicinity the presence of a toothbrush in the past five years that's crazy i got my coffee my michelob ultra superior like the beer ymca cup slash bottle slash hydro flask slash not really my infernal <sighs> What's up, man? What do you want to talk about? Gonna lurk a while while you play multi? Hey, no worries, man. Thank you for, uh, thank you for, thank you for the lurk. It is much appreciated. 
And you know what? Wait, it's been three hours already. Oh shit, has it? This is one of the games that I kind of get lost in. It's like. I got, it's like, I look up and I'm like, oh shit, three hours, non the cool day. No pray, no pray. It's a rat, so its teeth might have already replaced itself many times over. True. But I know for a fact this dude does not scrub his tongue. Even if he had known to use a toothbrush, I'm pretty sure the Skaven wouldn't, like, scrub their tongues. I guarantee it. <gasps> Clan Moors, yes! Let's talk to Clan Moors. I love Clan Moors. <laughs> We talk instead of fight kill, yes? Hmm? Yes. How can you best serve Clan Moors? Yes. Military access. Good, good. He's, okay, so out of all the voice acting in this game, I'd say Queek Headtaker and Deathmaster Snitch are my favorite. Queek Headtaker is such a cool character. I'm pretty sure, if he's still alive now, yeah, exactly. If he's still alive now, he's going to be top three. Easy. I want to bring him in. I want to bring him in. Eventually, we'll confederate with him and bring him in, and that way we can use him. Skaven Warlord. Because I'm pretty sure, pretty sure, uh, Queek's deal. He's a. Uh, he hates dwarves. So if he hasn't killed all the dwarves, we'll have a little bit more, uh, a few more dwarves to fight in the future. But I think we're ready to go. Wizard been valiant defeat. I think not, buddy. Let's go and grab. Yeah, five of these. Will not forget this time. I feel like Skaven culture actually actively like, actively just says, yeah, you probably shouldn't scrub your tongue. That's not the Skaven way, way. With the construction of his warpstone tractor beam, Ikit Claw has really outdone himself. Needless to say, any plan involving the invention of a device to pull giant chunks of warpstone down from orbit can only be thought of by an individual both deranged and brilliant in equal abundance. Whether or not Ikit will see his original plan through to the end and corrupt the Lizardmen's spawning pools? He isn't going to let any of the fallen warpstone go to waste, and those pesky lizard things better not get in his way either. If they do, they'll find themselves at the wrong end of his deadly demon... scourge. Demon... What's it called again? Demon something. Ikit has the biggest brain of all rats. That's actually saying a lot. Mm, that's the simple, masterful scheme. Yes, yes. <laughs> Watch First, out. Gather the fallen warp stone. All the warp stone. Second, make all these stinking reptiles die, die. Mm, murder, death. Kill devices at the ready. <laughs> Start my back little back demon back cannon, my little back. demon cannon. Used to wonder what friendship could be. All right, let's actually switch you guys out. You guys should go over here. You guys should come here. Um, that's good. I actually like having these guys at the back right over here is perfect actually you guys should group up have you guys back here ready to move up and in whenever we need ya you can actually be grouped up with the lords and our catapults will be there where are you you should try outs um you should come back here actually because i don't want you to get shot in the back by all of our best boys in blue well, not blue. They're technically in green, red, yellow. You know. Wizardmen scramble, cross their initial force. Yeah, we should be able to. Are they moving to us? Or do we have to go to them? Pretty sure we have to go to them. Shit. That's fine. Let's fast forward until everybody's in position. Pretty sure we're good. That's not red. That You know what? Yeah. Yeah, the, the Skaven are not really known for their weapon slash armor maintenance. Oh, shit. Uh, everybody. Right here. Right here is perfect, actually. Yep, because as soon as we started moving, they were like, mm, I think we're going to push up. Unfortunately, they will have the high ground of this on this hill, but hey, man. 
and do what we can. What is that? That's a fire salamander. Uh, or an ancient salamander, rather. These guys are the fire salamanders. They're all fire salamanders, chat. But, uh... You want to spawn this guy in. I forgot. A lot of the li uh, lizard men, at least the skinks, are very squishy. You fire directly in the center of all this nonsense. There you go. Hmm... Where are you hitting? Oh, the storm vermin? Uh-oh. That was not epic. You should be sniping their lord. Yeah, that hurts a little bit. That hurts a little bit. Oh, shit. Well, there he goes. The Lord is just absolutely dunked on. Gee, jeez. Uh, kill the Red Crested Skinks. Uh, these are just Skink cohorts, so they're not really much of a big deal. These guys are still firing on us, huh? That is nuts. Okay. How much? Ugh, yes, a lot of ammo. Okay, um... Tell you what, we got we gotta take him out. Otherwise, he's gonna be a huge issue for us in the future. Let's. Where's the sniper? You need to be firing on him. There's two of them, if I'm not mistaken. Make sure you guys are on guard mode, and we'll actually send our rat ogres up because we haven't seen them in action, at least not up close. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I love to see it. You should be firing on them. You should be firing on them. You're firing on them. Nasty Bubo sharpshooters focused on them. That's another ancient salamander. Okay. Okay. You go ahead and see off the red crested skinks. I'm actually going to send you over here to distract. I don't expect him to, uh, I don't expect these guys to stand and fight against this lizard. How are the plague mortars for Skaven? Uh, you mean the, what do you call the, the plague wind mortars? You mean the ones with the, the dudes that have the shit on their backs? Yes, they're really good. Their one drawback is range, but they're possibly one of the best anti-infantry units in the game, in my opinion. They're so good. Oh, no, 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 no. I appreciate the enthusiasm. I appreciate the enthusiasm, but we got to reform. You guys move up here. You guys here. Three. You guys should be on uh, guard mode only. That can't be everybody, right? No. Alright, you guys should snipe him. Because I'm pretty sure, yeah, that other that salamander just dipped. And sorry if I sorry, I got so into I got so into like Oh, they're flanking us? Bet. Enemy reinforcements from behind. It's fine. Reform! I don't need to reform that much, though. Let's go ahead and just do that. Have you guys right here. And you guys right here. There we go. Okay, good stuff, good stuff. You guys can actually just turn. No, because you're... <laughs> what a drag. We'll get Icky Claw in there. Oh, oh, yeah. Let's, let's... Oh, wait a minute. This will be a perfect time for me to nuke them. Yeah, let me get these rats in here real quick. Get these guys all nice and nice and ready. If the temple guards wanted to maybe... Joining the fight over here? Yes. Are these all temple guards? Source Warriors. Oh, 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 dude. Come on. All right. Are we going to hit where I say we hit this time? Why did you do that? I... Oh, that's so annoying. That's, that's genuinely annoying. That... Ugh. 
I click right there and the game's like, no, no, I have something better in mind. And proceeds to absolutely do the one thing I didn't need them to do. <laughs> that hurts a little bit, I'm not gonna lie. That, 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 that hurts a little bit. Unit has been wiped out, that's probably okay. I'm guessing that's okay. I mean, if it's not, it's gonna be okay today. Plot armor, I'm thinking so. I'm thinking that guy, at least one of these guys is the main character. Unfortunately, it's in a, it's in an anime that's not afraid to kill their main characters. Like, uh, I don't know, insert anime name there. Or TV show. Game of Thrones was uh, well known for killing established characters for a while until the last season, because everybody hates the last season, including me. That is Tepchik. Redo of a healer? I've never seen Redo of a healer. I'm gonna be honest, I usually stick to uh, Shonen and Sinan. Sainan? Sainan? I just started Vinland Saga. You said, please don't watch it, it's a rough one. I'll take your word for it, man. Oh shit, what are you doing? This dude summoned the heavens to, oh wow, I mean he's tearing through his own guys, so I'm not gonna complain. Uh, you really should be firing on the temple guards, actually. Yeah, we are tearing these guys apart. You don't need to get that close. These are right, they're right there. What are you doing? Stop. Yes, open fire. And you start casting magical spells. Yeah, these guys are about to get sniped off because they got a little too eager. A little too big for their britches. That's a shame. Okay, uh, I'll tell you what. Let's move Icky Claw in to kind of help do what we can. Drop the magical orb. Yeah, these guys just went feral. That's not good. For them or me. Not good for me because they're about to, uh... Well, I was going to say they're about to shit on my guys, but eh, I think we're doing okay. But when you say it's a rough one, do you mean rough in the sense that it's bad or rough in the sense that it's, like, just, like, like gnarly? If you know what I mean. Just, like, it can get gnarly. Because, like, Berserk gets gnarly. Ronmo one and a half is a fun anime from back in the day. Ooh. Dude, I'm always looking for more anime. Let me write that one down, actually. Ronmo one and a half. Not to sound arrogant, but this fight is already over. So I can just write stuff down. Unless that game decides, oh, wait a minute. Uh, the lizard men, they're crawling out of your, your, um, um. They're right on top of you. You know, anime to check out. Oh, excuse me. Redo makes Berserk look like it's Sailor Moon. There's no way I buy that. There is no way. Because I remember reading Berserk for the first time last year. I was like, Jesus fucking Christ. This is like, I have a pretty, like, I have a pretty high tolerance to like violence and that sort of, it was just like, like in, in, in fiction, it doesn't really bother me because it's like, it's not real. Berserk, Berserk had me fucked up for a little bit. I'm not going to lie to you. There were just times where I like had to close the book and just kind of like, <laughs> just like ruminate on what I had just read. Enemies forced to attack, land, or surrender the territory. I'm going to be honest, bro. I didn't even know you guys were here. I didn't know you guys had any flying units. Ranma one and a half. Go to GoGo -Go Anime and watch Redo of a Healer Uncensored and then enjoy it. Oh, yeah, I might check it out. I might check it out. It's entirely possible. Like I said, man, I'm always looking for more anime. And I just, and I'm waiting, uh, I'm waiting for my next issue of uh, Berserk to come in. I ordered that shit back in March. So I'm so, I'm really excited. All right, you guys, uh, see them off real quick. These guys, will they break eventually? Ripperdactyl Raptors. Uh, you guys just kind of let's pause because I don't need you guys getting any closer than you need to. Can you not fire up? Wait a minute. Can you not? <gasps> Wait a minute. Can they not fire up? Just a classic anime that makes you giggle deep I've never seen Dragon Ball. Which is going to be crazy for a lot of people. Because, like, apparently Dragon Ball is like... Is Dragon Ball one of the top three? We have nothing to counter them. That's crazy. 
we can't shoot them? What's uh, what's going on? <gasps> Wait a minute, are they glitched? There's no way. Hold up, let's see if we can lure them out. I'm gonna see if I can lure them out with Icket Claw on some of my. Uh... Let's do this. See if we can pull them into the battlefield. Cause right now I'm thinking what's going on is that they're just not fully on the. Quick, quick, get to the lift. On, on, run. Screen recap, crack. Face and hurry. All right, you guys wanna? Horn rats will. Oh, we feel. Oh, wait a minute. Can I? Do this? I don't think this is gonna do anything, but it might. I mean, it's gonna make them freeze, but. Are these guys just literally gonna fly in the air? That's stupid, man. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. There's no way. Oh, you got me fucked up. No shot. Can my catapults hit them at least? Oh, wait a minute. Maybe wolf lightning. No, no, I don't think so. So, Dragon Ball Z maybe top three Dragon Ball. You have to go look for it. Yeah, I mean I could probably find it on like um one of my you know one of the websites that I use to watch manga. One of the websites I use to watch manga. There we go. Oh, that's that's so annoying. Ugh. Am I gonna have to quit the game and then jump back in? Cause I, if I can see defeat. I'm gonna just concede defeat. That's no that 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 that's a little annoying. <laughs>